New Governor Michelle Lujan Grisham has unveiled her first proposed budget and it calls for a massive hike in spending. A lot of the new spending is geared toward public education. Here's News 13's Chris McKee with a glimpse of the 150 page budget. Chris. Yeah, Jessica, New Mexico's current budget is about where it was when the recession hit a decade ago. Now, Governor Lujan Grisham wants to change that in a big way with a huge influx of oil money to play with this year. The governor wants to pour another 700 million into the budget, taking it up more than $7 billion. That's a 13% spike. Half a billion would go to public education, including money for much longer school years for struggling schools, an extra three days for all schools, more pre-K and 6% raises for teachers on top of raising their minimum salaries. The governor stated on the campaign trail that she'd like to dip into the state's permanent fund to help pay for all of this. Now, her budget also calls for a boost in CYFD spending, some of it to hire 100 more caseworkers and more money for the courts to help get the justice system moving. The session starts Tuesday, and of course, the Democrats now have firm control in the House and Senate as well. Jess, back to you. All right, thank you, Chris. Outside the recurring budget, the governor also wants to spend $300 million to pay off the backlog of movie tax credits.